Good morning, it's uh, Tuesday 29th of June 2021 and we've got a little bit of an update on the news uh, here in Mallorca. So yesterday, Monday, the Spanish Prime Minister Pedro Sanchez announced that travellers coming from the UK uh, would have to un undergo some restrictions. They would have to prove that they had a negative PCR test uh, or that they'd had two vaccinations. Well, things have become a bit clearer today with an announcement uh, given by uh, one of the ministers through a tweet who said that the bulletin is going to be produced today. So today's Tuesday and the time frame is 72 hours from today. So this will all come into effect on Friday, uh, not, not Thursday or Wednesday as people were assuming. Uh, it's going to come in on Friday. And what does it actually mean? Well, it means that uh, if you're traveling from the UK from Friday, you've got to show that you were vaccinated with one of the approved vaccines. So whatever that one, if it required two vaccinations, you must have had both of them. And you must have had it within the time frame they allow, which is usually 14 days before you travel. So you must have had them both 14, at least 14 days before you travel. Uh, if you haven't had both vaccinations, you can still travel, but you must have a PCR test. There was a little bit of confusion at the beginning because uh, people thought that uh, the, they were going to follow the rules for the European Union, but the European Union are, are allowed to come here uh, with an antigen test, uh, which is obviously a lot cheaper than the PCR test. For the UK travellers, uh, that is not allowed. It is the PCR test. This is according to El País. It's one of the respected newspapers here in Spain uh, and they have it in their uh, newspaper today, this, the English-speaking version of their newspaper. Uh, all of the rules will be produced later on today in the BOE, which is the official gazette, the official bulletin of the Spanish government, uh, and that should have all of the details in. So. Uh, that's the thing that we need to follow a little bit later on. So at the moment it is a PCR test and uh, you can show that you've had both vaccinations. Um, some people were asking me yesterday what about children who haven't had it under 18s? Well the rule for the European Union is if they are 12 and over they have to have the test and if you're under 12 then they don't need to have the test. There is a Spanish website where you can go to and you have to fill in a form and you'll get a QR code for your mobile phone. I guess that can be printed out um, but you're going to have to make sure your paperwork's all in order before you arrive uh, here in Palma. There have been pictures as well uh, in Palma Airport of long queues, how they're going to organise this when it gets into the airport. I think it's going to be a big problem in the next few days where they're expecting a huge influx of passengers. So I'll keep you updated on that when we hear anything. This may come as bad news for the UK travellers, but it's good news for the people who are working in the hotel industry here and the service industry in bars and restaurants who were very concerned about people coming over to Mallorca who might be carrying the disease, especially from the UK when they weren't required to have any proof that they'd not uh, had the disease or didn't have the disease, they could just come. Uh, and this, this has all been exasperated by the fact that uh, some students came uh, a week or so ago and uh, had a really big party here. Uh, thousands of students, all from the mainland of Spain, and when they went back uh, they were tested and reported lots of new cases and some of the reports are saying up to a thousand cases came from this one event here in Mallorca and not only are the cases the thousand that have tested positive but there are two or three thousand who now have to be isolated uh, just because they were here in Mallorca on Jolly. Some of them are actually isolated here uh, in the hotel in the Paseo Maritimo and uh, they obviously don't like being here. Uh, the parents don't like them being here. Some of them must be under 18, uh, but they're here and they've got to spend their time in their hotel room in quarantine. So that's what's caused this uh, uh, change for the UK passengers or one of the things that's prompted it. 
And uh, so from Friday, if you're coming to Mallorca, you've got to show that you've had two vaccines uh, or you're going to have to show a negative PCR test. If you haven't already subscribed, good idea to subscribe to the channel and uh, then you'll get a notification. Hit that bell and it gives you an indication of when I've added, added a new video. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next update. Bye for now.